Hello and welcome to this presentation of Excel to Sage. My name is Aura Martirosian and I'm going to show you how to import eBay orders into Sage. So what's Excel to Sage? Well, it's the final piece of the Sage puzzle. You can use it for all your integration needs with Sage. It works from things like databases like MySQL and SQL Server, as well as bringing in orders from all the major e-commerce sites, Amazon, eBay, Shopify, uh, as well as any other um, bespoke web shops that you might be using. It links to billing systems. Uh, it allows you to import stuff from EDI uh, so you can uh, uh, deal with major retailers like Tesco's, Amazon, uh, sorry, Tesco's, uh, Morrison's and so on. And it uh, also allows you to import data from all the normal file formats like Excel, XML, CSV and so on. So what can I use it for? Well, you can use it for all the major day-to-day -day transactions. It can import master data, static data like customers and suppliers, but it also can bring in transactional data like sales orders, purchase orders, journals, and it works for things like uh, charities as well. It has a log file, which is very informative and allows you to see any errors with your data uh, very easily so that you can rectify it and rerun the import. So let's look at the eBay order in particular. So eBay provide an awful lot of columns of information and what we need to do is uh, what uh, uh, the, the, the import does is it looks at those and then uh, actions them appropriately or accordingly. So in this eBay example, we've got the item number and that item number would be the item number that's used on eBay. However, that will be different to the product code in Sage. So we have a very simple Excel lookup which matches one with the other and during the import then allows us to import the um, Amazon, sorry, the uh, eBay product code and replaces it with a Sage one. So let's have a look at it in action. So if I go in here, I haven't got any sales orders at the moment and uh, what I'll do is I'll go to the folder and this is the eBay order that I've just downloaded today. So all I need to do, having downloaded that, is to press one button, which is the eBay button. What that will do is it will start off this little black box and what that black box is telling me is that it's now going to import the eBay sales orders. It's going to go and have a look at that Excel spreadsheet, open it up and then it will then do all the lookups for the products and everything else and will then create individual sales orders in Sage. After it's done that, uh, a notepad file will then open up showing us all the sales orders that have been imported into Sage so that we can then go and just double check it just to make sure there aren't any errors or anything like that. Uh, and having done that, this, the import is then completed and we can then close the notepad file and uh, uh, check it in Sage. There it is, there's the notepad file. So let's have a quick look at that. So it's gone through and it's imported eight separate sales orders into Sage for us. So I'll now just close the notepad file and we'll then just refresh Sage and here we are the Excel to Sage Automation eBay import. So let's go and have a look at what B and Borg ordered. So B and Borg ordered some boards and some calculators. Uh, there's uh, got some references in terms of how he paid for it using PayPal. I can open that up and I can see that uh, he bought them at five pounds each and the um, ID that uh, eBay used. Um, I've got his name and address that's been filled in. These are all going to a single eBay account in Sage, but obviously each one of the sales orders will have a different address on it uh, for shipping purposes. And we've got details of the payment ID, how it was delivered, and any transactional information that eBay provides us. So really simple. Download the eBay order, press one button. So what are the benefits? Well, lots of benefits. It's very easy to set up and use, typically less than 15 minutes, and you get a full 30-day trial. Uh, it's sold on an annual license plan, and for that you get all of the new features that are added to it during the period, as well as free software upgrades so that you can keep in um, sync with Sage upgrades at the same time. Uh, you also get full email and remote access support from our uh, very... Um, uh, um, uh, professional uh, support team. Discounts on our other solutions is something that uh, we offer our valued clients and we've got things like mobile to Sage which allow you to front end Sage with an iPhone or an iPad, EDI to Sage which allows you to say to link Sage to uh, the major retailers like Tesco's, Morrison's and so on. We have something called Sage Report Scheduler which allows you to schedule your reports outside the business hours so it can be done overnight and emailed to you. And we've also got uh, a credit control solution called Doc Hyperlink, which allows you to email statements out to customers and then give them the ability to click on a hyperlink to get a copy 
invoices. And we've got lots and lots of other solutions as well. Uh, so I would uh, um, invite you to have a look at our YouTube channel and our website. Thank you very much for your time and interest in our eBay order import using Excel to Sage. Please feel free to contact me to either arrange a free trial or uh, to discuss your requirements. Thank you.